Today is a wonderful day to go picking or collecting feet for our rose chaver. Look how beautiful it is here along the Kurfürsten, along Lake Wallensee in Switzerland. I have a special place where I know that always the wind blows the leaves uh, to a little tall stone wall and the wind dries it out also and here you can collect easily within one two minutes or 10 20 minutes some bags of feed for your rose chavis it's the rotten leaves of two trees oak here an oak leaf and the rest of the leaves this leathery thing these are the leaves of beech if you're not sure what kind of trees there are just look around you and you will see it easily so that's the place so here in front are two oaks and just where i stand is a huge beech tree so that's the producers of the feed material for our rose chavis mostly the upper layer is dried that's no problem and the deeper we get the wetter the leaves are and now they are becoming rotten just on the surface of the earth and that's exactly the food our rose chavers like because this is already broken down from mushrooms that you see the white myce mycelium in here and that's exactly the thing they like and when they eat a lot of this stuff they will become big and stay healthy so it's the best time now to collect some of this material and you see here it goes fast So in no time you have some bags filled with the best feed for rose chaver you can imagine. And you see here that's only about 20 meters along the stone wall and I collected 10 bags, around 600 liters of these rotten leaves. No, that lasts for a month. <laughs> and for storage I put them upside down the bags because I don't want to have water inside the bags so in this kind of storage the leaf material stays uh, a little more dry and can rot easily inside the bags like it rots inside a hollow tree and that's all and if you see a man like this from now on you know what he's doing <laughs> 